first time in China, man, uh, experience is crazy. What I what I thought, what I imagined it would be, it was that and ten times more. Uh, the people, the energy, how many of them there are, their, their customs, the way they speak, the way they act, the way they greet you. They're, 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 it's an energy to, the, to China that I never really expected. I mean, the experience is off the chain. Beijing's getting down to the, the roots of China. It's the capital, much, not much change there. The, the culture is the same as it was. It's the, it's the grid of China. It's the, it's the city, you know, from the, uh, from the marketplaces, uh, to the people, to the, their experience, their, their, their energy is, is China. <laughs> At the Great Wall, Great Wall was crazy, man. We're heading up a gondola, uh, up, you know, a couple hundred feet into the air, up the mountain to just to get there. And these people walked, you know, barefoot through the snow uh, to build that to protect the city. It's an experience. I think it's something, something everybody should be able to do, be able to see. Especially kicking the season off like this, this the, you know, the right way. We're walking up and down the steps, and like. It almost gets vertical at some points, and some, some spots miss it. I mean, it's crazy, but to think that these people went there and, and, and built that, and as long and as, as, as wild as it is, I mean, it, it's a, a feat in itself. The uh, you're the reason everybody tried to offer me a robe out there. <laughs> I like it, man. When I get out the shower, I can throw it on. <laughs> Getting to know people is, is a great bonding experience, and just for our team, that's that's the the best way to kick things off. I think it's kind of a blessing in disguise. I think we kind of complain about the traveler, you know, all the stuff they got us doing right now. But I think in the long run, I mean. Getting off to a start like this, I mean, it's bonding. Absolutely. You know, you know, normally at home we wouldn't really see each other this much, but you know, being on the road with each other for a week in a different country, time on the bus, you know, the long plane rides, time at practice, is stuff that you know is invaluable. I, I feel as far as chemistry goes, and um, you know, getting to know everybody and kind of making everybody feel at home. We had a week of training camp. Um, you know, guys were here and there during the summer, but it's like being thrown in the fire going up against the world champs uh, in China, and this may be preseason, but I'm gonna tell you one thing, it don't feel like preseason. In Shanghai, it's the, it's the fast pace, the new buildings, um, it's the lights, the glamour, the, the technology, you know, that, that, that's what we all see, we, we think of China. Like New York on steroids. I'm, I'm looking across, looking out the window. I probably see hundreds of, of sky rise buildings. I mean, that, that, that's crazy. Headed to Nazing Row. We did some shopping in. Um, you know, kind of had practice, a little day off, and uh, you know, a chance to kind of get around the city a little bit. Forgot to check out what Shanghai has to offer. This is something we grew up on the streets playing, and you never imagined that you'd be in, in China and there's to be somebody rubbing your jersey or your team or cheering for you to, you know, just do something that you grew up doing. I mean, you you come in the gym and like they know you. They're waiting outside the buses. They they got the camera phones out. They're snapping. You know, people that can't even speak English don't even understand. And the horns in the background. That's what it is. We shut it down, baby. You see the streets. Lob City, baby, Shanghai. Peace. My hometown guy, and then 
my first games as a, as a Clipper repping Los Angeles, repping Pasadena out in China. You got people, you know, giving it up for what we stand for and gives you just kind of overall feel of how, how amazing just that, that simple ball and that hoop <laughs> that we grew up playing with is and, uh, you know, just the effect on itself. My love, my passion is basketball. And, you know, today I think, it, you know, just this trip kind of hits me that playing basketball in the streets, going to the parks, right on your bike, whatever it took just to get on that court, you know, it's taking me halfway around the world. And you, you really got to put that in a perspective. What's up, man? We're in the building. I got a hot 16. The boy is mean. The game is clean. 